100 jams where hit music lives. G Easy Chris Brown provide. Right about now, it's time for Chat Trap. Letting you know what's happening in the media. Talking about all the juicy headlines today. So, of course, we know time is officially winding down, right? And, well, it actually kind of just begun because hurricane season started today. So, I'll keep you up to date, keep you posted on how many storms they say it's actually supposed to be heading our way. But, like you know, you already know, Chat Trap is brought to you by Easy Payday Loans. And Easy Payday Loans is always hooking you up, keeping you connected. And remember that you do not need luck when you've got Easy Payday Loans. Their loans are simple, fast, and easy. We're talking about instant approval. Eligible applicants can borrow up to $15,000. Just call to begin your loan loan process today, 603-0200, or visit them at their new location on University Drive. So let's get into talking about the 2020 Olympics, which is quickly approaching. It's actually supposed to be held from July 23rd to August 8th. But the big question for months now is, will the games be canceled in Japan due to their recent surge, COVID-19 surge? But I don't know, because I think they're still kind of trying to figure it out. But athletes are already have been arriving in Japan, and this is allegedly putting more pressure on their prime minister, as they may possibly may just think about canceling it, because the games can cause a bigger risk instead of, you know, crippling their new wave of the pandemic. So they, I don't know, it's just been all over the place from the start. And I know a lot of athletes, they've been one to compete, seeing that the fact that they have been practicing, they've been in training, they've been waiting for the games. And of course, you know, we want to see the Bahamas race as well. So I'll just keep you posted. But one of the Japanese opposition leader, Adano, who's the head of the Constitutional Democratic Party, said that based on what the government has said so far, he didn't see how the games could be held safely. And if the lives and livelihoods of the people cannot be protected, they will have no choice but to give up holding the games. And yeah, so it just might be canceled. But sports fan in Japan who would be looking forward to attend, they would even have to give um, full proof of vaccination or a negative COVID-19 test. Going to keep you posted on that right there. But of course, today is June 1st. Nothing exciting. It's not exciting at all. Maybe that's why it's raining. But it's the official start of the Atlantic hurricane season with experts predicting an above average year for storms. So the National Oceanic and Atmospheric Adm Administration Climate Prediction Center includes a range of 13 to 20 named storms. That's about winds of 39 miles per hour or higher, of which 6 to 10 could become hurricanes, and that's winds of 74 miles per hour or higher, including 3 to 5 major hurricanes. That's about Category 3, 4, or 5, with winds of 111 miles per hour or higher. So I just say right now during this time, we want to get ourselves prepared just because of what we experienced last in the Hurricane Dorian. We just do not know what to expect. And now, of course, last year we did dodge a lot. So you got to thank God for that. Got to definitely be appreciative for that. But you just never know what may be coming our way this year. So keep your fingers crossed and continue to start praying because, boy, oh, boy, things are, yeah, just got you on the, you know, the edge of your seat. Got you walking on toes right now. And it's just so sad to see just recently, though, that um, a rapper, Lil Loaded, um, well, he actually passed away. Well, he committed suicide, and they allegedly said that he committed suicide after he found out that his girlfriend was cheating on him. I'm not sure how true this is, but this is the story right now that's hitting headlines, and it's just so sad to see a lot of these young artists are just passing away so quickly before they're even able to make a real name for themselves in the business. So it's almost like when you listen to new artists today, you don't know if they're going to be around 10 years from now. I mean, two years, two weeks from now, sometimes you never know. So I'm just hoping that, you know, when it comes to the business, rap business, of course, that this slows up. But that's it for Chat Trap. Letting you know a bit about what's going on in the media. Chat Trap is brought to you by Easy Payday Loans. Easy Payday is giving you low fees and the most competitive rates on any loan you apply for. Instant loans, auto loans, loan consolidation, and quick financial assistance. So refer a friend and Easy Payday Loans will pay you $100. When you as an existing client refer a friend, terms and conditions do apply. Call or visit today, 603-0200, or visit them at their new location on University Drive.